Hello everyone and welcome back to Coded by Jade. This summer, I know a lot of students are going to decide what they want to do post 18. And in these days, there's a lot of speculation as to whether a university degree is even necessary for a software engineering job or any other job in the tech industry. Well, in this video, I'll be explaining why I'm planning to go to university to pursue a computer science degree rather than a degree apprenticeship or coding bootcamp. And this video will be in addition to my series, How I'm Preparing for University. So be sure to check that out using the playlist linked below after this video. Before I start this video, be sure to like and subscribe as well as pressing post notifications as it helps the channel and lets me know to produce more content along these lines. My first reason why I'm choosing to go to university rather than a coding bootcamp is that, in the UK at least, student loan isn't too much of a big deal. So, as you can see in this picture here, the average debt of student loan was about £45,000 and only 25% of these people on average pay these out in full. And after 30 years, the student loan is um, completely erased and you don't have to pay any more. And what's good about student loan in the UK is that you only have to pay after reaching the personal allowance, which is around 25k. So even paying back means that you lose out on money. So to picture this properly, I know that I want to go along the lines of a machine learning engineer and the starting role for that is around £35,000. And as you can see, um, I've used the salary calculator to show these figures. I'll only be paying about £57 per month to for this take-home salary. And if I was to pay this out in full, it would be 66 years to pay it out. But in reality, in 30 years, I'll only be paying £20,000, assuming that this is my own salary for the rest of the career. The next reason why I'm choosing to go to university rather than a coding boot camp is that I actually enjoy academia. Coding camps teach you how to use certain technologies such as JavaScript React or Amazon Web Services, building projects using these technologies. But I want to go to university to learn why and how these things come about, such as learning programming language design and theory about how the internet works. I don't mind being in a classroom setting and in fact I know that based on my own self-led projects that actually being in a classroom gives me more guidance on learning about computer science than any other subject in general. And I know that I have the time management skills and the enthusiasm to pursue side projects on my own that are typically made at coding boot camps and I can do this in my own time and still have enough time to build a portfolio for summer internships and spring breaks etc. Next, I know this may sound weird to hear but at the start of year 12, I realised that I might not actually want to just be a software engineer and therefore a coding camp would limit my potential in computer science. I'm not sure about the typical graduate job route I want to take, but perhaps I want to take other roles that are not orthodox, such as systems development and processor design. And by not orthodox, I mean like right now the hype is generally software engineering, working at Google or other fan companies, but I might decide that I want to do something else, such as, um, as I've said, the systems development working with C and C++, which are um, not typical um, to web development and other common software development routes. And I want to explore these options, and I know that the best way I can do so is at university. And therefore, as I said, coding camps are often software and web development focused and I don't think I'll achieve the same academic satisfaction at coding camp rather than going to university. And finally, the last reason why I'm choosing to go to university rather than a coding camp is that I believe that universities generally give more exposure to the professional world and career opportunities than a coding boot camp can. For example, universities provide career advice services and the university I will be attending actually has personal career tutors that can help you with your CV and find job opportunities that are suited for you in the summer and placements, etc. And um, pre-pandemic and maybe post-pandemic as we head into September, there are career fairs that I can network in. 
And as I said, there's more guidance on summer internships, which gives the opportunity to gain professional experience alongside my degree, which gives me the satisfaction of learning um, computer science theory in more depth rather than just learning programming language, as well as gaining those that professional experience using those programming language that I do choose to learn. And in essence, university plus summer and even spring internships gives me the opportunity to have the best of both worlds of being theoretical and my practical knowledge. If you're planning on applying to study computer science at university, then be sure to check out my video on how to write a great personal statement for computer science for a top UK university. I also have a preparing for university series that I've talked about and the playlist is screenshotted here for you to check out to be at your A game while applying for computer science at university. So all in all, that's why I've chosen to study computer science at university over a coding camp. Be sure to let me know what path you have taken or wish to take in the comments. Thanks for watching and remember to like this video and subscribe for more content. Bye.